What's up everyone? So yeah, I have been a little MIA and then I'm pretty much going to bombard everyone with a lot of videos. So some of them are going to be longer, some of them aren't. It's mainly just me working, but I have not been able to find time to edit anything right now. My room is trashed because I have been trying to create new items and do all that and get the more items loaded on the women's boutique and then my Etsy blew up and I have been non-stop it is three o'clock in the morning and I have seven daisy dresses I need to get done today and out today and a western set and a moto set and I think I have a rush order coming in I need to get three videos edited but no one has been wanting to sleep Jake's uh Jake took another um, different position down at work so therefore his shifts have changed so we've been getting readjusted to that but he is putting in my wall today in the basement so I, it's not going to be painted or anything, so it's not going to be pretty at first, but you know what? Hey, it'll do. Um, that's going to go on today, so that's why I'm not even worried about cleaning because, or organizing, because I'm going to be moving anyways, and I'm going to be organizing everything down there. So, that's happening. Um, I think I told you guys on another video that... Don't mind me because I'm going to try to print out orders and shipping labels and stuff like that while I'm doing this because I need to get my butt moving. But I'm pretty sure I mentioned it on the last video. Gage had his one ENT appointment because we couldn't get him in with the one at Children's until September. So I got him into one... Um, with another hospital around here. Uh, as soon as the doctor had him open his mouth and he looked down at the doctor, it was like, those are huge. They need to go. So he, we still have to wait till um, his appointment with Children's Hospital. And he said most likely they are definitely going to take them. So even though it's not like a big deal because it's just his tonsils. He says it's the same surgery for everyone. He is very young to have it though. And that the youngest he has ever operated on was four. And Gage is also going to have to have a sleep study. So, um, it is, it's just been chaos. <laughs> it's been just nerve wracking and chaos. And yeah. There's been so much stuff going on. I just really haven't, haven't prioritized, I guess, YouTube. So I'm sorry about that guys, but I'm going to do my best to come back and show you guys the new items I made and I'm working on, get ready to do a room tour. But yeah, things have just been a little bit crazy. So that is my little life update right there. I'm not going to talk probably much anymore because I know most likely Atticus is going to be waking up here soon or something. Oh, that's nice. I just looked on Etsy and it says potential UPS labor strike. I don't really use UPS, but for anyone who does, that's not very good, but I mean, you know, ugh. And postpartum it's full on set in with my hair loss. I am shedding like crazy. I'm shedding crazy. I think my hormones are finally starting to calm down a little bit. I'm not fully there. But yeah, it's 
it's just been so much going on, but I am not going to really talk anymore. I'm going to get my butt in gear and I'm going to get this stuff done and hopefully get videos edited today and more orders out and my new items made. But I'm probably going to have to try to split this up throughout today. I might take the kids to my mom's just so I can get everything done and Jake can actually work on the wall. Because it's not just a wall, we have to actually put a door in to separate into the laundry room and stuff. <sighs> There's just so much going on. We still haven't finished our bathroom. We still have to do that. It's just been... It has been non-stop and it has been very hard adjusting and trying to get on a schedule. Especially with three kids, me running my Etsy shop and Jake now switching schedules. So anyways, all right, I'm going to get to work. Let's freaking do this. side over there so yeah I am going to get all of these done Three kids, constant cleaning, three kids at like three and under. I'm exhausted, but I get shit done, so. And again, I have been working on orders like freaking crazy, so everything is a giant mess. And actually, I think, um, I might be taking down his playpen today, I don't know. Because he kind of uses it and kind of doesn't, so. Alright, I get this done. I tr I'm going to try to get different angles while I'm working. So maybe that, like, helps since I really can't do, like, how-to videos right now until I get to the basement because my kid's always screaming. But, well, we're going to see how this goes, so. Now that you should know, I've been going solo Want my love, baby, earn it, yeah Dancing on my own, see if you can follow Got me feeling alive Watch me go
inspired by thirst I'm inspired by worth I desire your worst So you can just hide while I work I ain't tired, you first I'll write a second, third verse About the lies you go disperse You never did sh- I know it hurts But something deep inside won't let me still working on daisy dresses it is 8 24 and i still have three daisy dresses left to do my custom rush order did come through this morning so i have to get that done today on top of two western sets a couple other shirts embroidered and moto set and everything else so it's gonna be a very busy day we decided jake just left for his doctor's appointment that's why he's off today because he had a doctor's appointment but um and he's gonna finish grabbing what we need to finish the wall downstairs but yeah he we decided that by the time i would get the kids ready and head out to my mom's house and then come back home and then <laughs> try to go get them <clears throat> and I would end up losing probably about two hours of work and only get like maybe two hours of work kid free so there's really no point right now because they just woke up like I said it's 8 30 so by the time I would get them ready I gotta get them breakfast and everything else there's no point in taking them out today so I'm just going to try to get this stuff done and um, yeah make the best of it so I tried to film a little bit. This is probably going to be a long vlog, but I tried to actually film a little bit of um, the daisy dress process since, like I said, it's kind of hard for me to do like a how-to. Atticus is actually up too, but he's over. He passed back out right now, so kind of just he's over in his old playpen. Way I don't have to run upstairs and get him when he wakes up. So I try to show a little bit more in depth on how I make these things. Soon, guys. Soon. Soon, soon, soon. I will have tumblers on here and freshies and hats and all kinds of stuff because as soon as I get reorganized and situated which I don't think all of my stuff is gonna fit in the basement like I said we live in a very small house I have a lot of shit so I don't think everything's gonna fit in the basement I'm gonna do my best to try to get as much stuff down there especially the machines so I can use them 
but um, I don't know how I'm gonna get my one fabric shelf downstairs because you guys, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it. I'll have to show you whenever I go into the next room. It's like one of those giant cubby things. And it's full of fabric, so and I had it downstairs originally, and I had it full of yarn and um, yarn and sketchbook. So that was kind of like easy to take off, and because if I haven't said it on here, I've actually been crocheting since I was nine, and. Um, Really my thing like growing up was crocheting and drawing and painting and doing that stuff and then sewing came along and then of course there's all these other things out here that you can get into so that um yeah that uh kind of how everything happened but actually crocheting I used to crochet blankets all the time I just loved crocheting like lap robes and just I ended up giving them away I just donated them so but to me another one but I'll show you guys real quick my house is a mess I have not cleaned it yet this morning I have just been working and trying to get this stuff done but I need to change my curtains in here that's why it's so pink because that curtain actually fell because I had all my patterns on it but that is my fabric sorry if I just made you guys dizzy fabric shelf and then of course I have all that fabric and then I ended up taking that closet door off and that's all fabric fabric and other stuff more fabric over there that's actually a project I am working on I have not gotten to yet but That is for the women's boutique. So that is coming. I forgot the headband. But that is actually coming too. I will be showing you guys what I'm gonna be doing with that. Right now, like I said though, there's just been so much stuff going on. I'm a little behind on everything and um, kind of just more keeping an eye on my family's health. So that's priority. Priority. But I found this super cute thing on, um, I think this was off of Creative Fabrica. I think it was. I should be using my paper cutter for this. But you know what? I don't feel like taking it out. But find the beauty in the small things. How cute is that? And I put the little daisy headband on that. Just something, I don't know. Like a happy little quote for the day. So. I hate how I hate how it's like when you run out of something it's not just like one thing it's like everything I ran out of all my cellophane bags I had to reorder those then I ordered the wrong size so then I had to order more which the wrong size that I ordered I end up do using but then I'm almost out of stabilizer I have to order stabilizer I'm almost out of heat and bond I have to order that what the hell else? I'm almost out of poly mailers. It's just like, I know there's other things that I'm almost out of. I swear, it's like when... It's like you literally run out of things all at once. And it just sucks. 
boxes and it's like, oh, I got all this money coming in. And then it's like, oh shit, I got to order all kinds of stuff. I literally just tried to stock up on daisy fabric because it is officially super low in stock. I think last time I checked, it was like 80 yards left. And um, I have one full bolt, one partial bolt. I ordered two more full bolts because I was not like selling any daisy dresses for a bit. It was actually a whole bunch of other stuff and then stuff blew up. And then of course the stuff I make my best out of for the cowboy sets, it was like discontinued. Then they brought it back and now it's like, um, get it while you can kind of thing. And last time I checked, they only had, I think they had like 883 yards left and it was going pretty fast. So I ordered in a bowl of that just to have because I only have two yards. And of course I got a whole bunch of Western sets in. So I swear it's just like it literally, but hopefully we'll be ready for, you know, the fall birthday seasons and stuff like that. Cause so usually last year, I think that's when I sold most of my western sets okay i'm done rambling i'm gonna go put this in the mailbox and get back to making daisy dresses It's, what time is it? 1.20. It's 1.20 and I was able to get five orders out. So I still have five more I need to get done. But we are going to go start on the wall. And the little kitty, I guess. I like my tongue. Hmm? I like my tongue. Uh-huh. What? Nothing, but we are gonna go start on the wall. Well, Jake's gonna go start on the wall. I'm going to go start cleaning stuff up down there and trying to organize what I do have down there. And then I will get back to orders tonight. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna end the vlog here or not, but a craft room tour will be coming soon. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Whew. All right, guys, so you can see Ragnar is still behind me. Um, it is 6.28. We got some of the wall worked on and we just took the kids outside for a little bit. I came in and I am 
going to get ready to edit two older um, videos, footages that I've had and then I have six more orders I need to work on. I think I'm going to go take a nap. I know and I appreciate everyone being like, you need to sleep and you need to do this, but at the same time too. I'm trying to build a <laughs> trying to build a business and more so I can keep staying at home with my kiddos and hopefully maybe one day my husband can be at home with me and us and just he can do all of his stuff. So I am going to if you guys keep following along with me and you um, see the two videos that I'm going to edit and post before, I'm going to try to do this like a boom, boom, boom kind of day thing. Load three videos in three days. So this way everyone kind of has an understanding where I've been. But I know it's only been like, I think maybe a week and a half. I don't know. But... <sighs> Atticus keeps dropping his bank. I'm also hoping too that maybe this weekend I will actually get to dye my hair back to how I want it to be. So, but anyways, thank you guys for watching if you've watched this long and thank you guys for hanging out and thank you guys for all of the support because it's so much appreciated i know some of my youtube videos are probably boring but again i started youtube to actually build a community and track my process and progress um on the business so yeah I'm exhausted. I'm <laughs> gonna try to get a little bit more work done and I think I might actually soak in the tub for a little bit and take a nap. So thank you guys. I appreciate everything and I will see you guys in the next vlog. Alright.